To take the words right out of Michael Cole's mouth, that match delivered. That was an awesome match. That is why you like professional wrestling. This is why we watch this stuff. AJ Styles and Finn Balor went out and delivered one hell of an awesome match that uh, makes you know the reason why we are sitting here watching TLC. That we know every once in a while a match like this is going to come along. I'm not saying this is going to be match of the year, but... To me, that brought back tingles inside of my chest that made me realize why I love professional wrestling. Finn Balor reminds me why I think he is the blue chipper that will save WWE and take it to the new level um, that it needs to be at sooner than later. AJ Styles was the perfect uh, person for him to have a match against. Uh, this match was was made because of the fact that uh, some superstars got sick. AJ Styles had to take a flight where he was he was traveling from Santiago, Chile, for over uh, I believe it was 16 hours on a plane just to wrestle this match and um, find a way to save the sh the, 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 this this show. To me, honestly, I really think that it did do that for the fact that. Um, these guys went out there. This was not a number one contenders match. It was not a championship match. But this was just for pride of who the better wrestler, who the better competitor was. And there's probably more that's going to come out of this match. But now um, them advertising um, Survivor Series is once again SmackDown versus Raw. I know that we've already pretty much set up that we're going to have... Oh, look at the two sweets right there in the ring. We've already pretty much said... God, people are going to be talking about that. I didn't even think about it until I did it. People are going to be talking about that a lot. Keyboard, keyboard warriors right now talking about the Bullet Club and uh, the Young Bucks and all sorts of rumors going to be coming out of that right there. Um, you know, but, uh, you know, to see Finn Balor actually put the demon paint on and actually get a big win against AJ Styles um, means a lot to me. And I got scared there when they turned out the lights during Phil's, uh, during uh, Finn's reaction, because I was scared they were gonna do some sort of uh, sort of Sister Abigail Bray Wyatt deal. And I thought it was funny, honestly, that Michael Cole said at one point that uh, uh, you know he was supposed to wrestle against Bray Wyatt tonight. And I was like, hey, I thought it was supposed to be be against Sister Abigail. But uh, with now SmackDown versus Raw at Survivor Series, maybe we'll get to see this once again as, as some sort of a rematch. Um, I, w I would love to see it. This match was awesome, and I think that it really um, just just knocked it out of the park. This was a really, really good match. Um, def I, 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 it, TLC always is a freaking awesome match, but it's going to be hard to see how they top this, honestly, in my mind. I, I really want it. That's all I can say. All of their backstory with, uh, um, you know, the, the Bullet Club. They talk about the Bullet Club without talking about the Bullet Club tonight. But uh, the Coupe de Grasse, one, two, three. AJ goes back to SmackDown. All I can say is I want to see it again.